Okay, this is my Honda A horsepower exhaust seal. So I'm going to open this up, even though um, I don't see any um, visible damage. But I decided to open it to see um, you know what the heck is going on inside maybe that is, there is nothing wrong and you can see all the screws are so they look so brand new I don't see any video um, about this. That's why I'm doing this on YouTube. There's one, you can see the screws are totally brand new. trying to see if I need to buy a see these screws this look like it's brand new if I need to buy a brand new exhaust seal see you can see the seal look brand new it doesn't look like broken to me there we go wow wow This seal does not look like broken to me. You know, yes, a lot of dirt, sand in here, but I don't notice anything that's broken. So I'm just gonna clean this up. And then, um, see all the gunk. Maybe that, maybe those are the gunk that's creating the See that? Oh my goodness. Maybe that's why this thing is leaking because of these, the, the dirt got into here. So I'm going to clean this out and then, um, no video on YouTube video. That's why I'm doing this video for you. You know, I hope to help you, you know, but this is, um, a lot of dirt from a uh, sailboat using, you know, go to the beach and stuff. Okay. So. Here you go. Okay, just to show you how bad this thing, how bad this dirt this thing got. You can see here, I'm uh, cleaning out this thing and uh, so much dirt on this thing. You can see all the dirt. See all the dirt. These are the dirt that's preventing this seal from doing its job. You know, so I'm gonna wash it. Then we'll come back. Um, and then same thing here. I'm just gonna clean this. So there.
I was hoping I may be able to use what do you call that degreaser simple green but then this is rubber so I don't want to use the rubber I mean simple green to clean this thing so I um, decided just to you know wash it off like this and then uh, do the best I can to, to um, clean this clean this uh, exhaust seal and then put it back and hopefully this will seal better because all the you know dirt are uh, clean out of here so I should have a better seal um, of the outboard this is the Honda a horsepower by the way exhaust seal okay Gosh, my hands are so dirty now. You gotta do a really good wash. So this is metal, and this is rubber, and uh, it's amazing how they were able to make the rubber onto this metal piece or a composite, um, some kind of um, yeah, it is metal, and um, you know this rubber lip is still in a very good shape goes to tell you that this outboard a horsepower is lightly used you know very lightly used you know so okay there you have it I gotta wash my hand now okay this is exhaust uh, got so much dirt in there where my thumb is pointing you know so you know when I uh, so this is kind of leaking and uh, leaking the exhaust gas and uh, into the um, into the power head and um, it's uh, smothering the carburetor so now um, I cleaned it clean out all the dirt and uh, the seal looks completely okay so I'm just gonna reuse it and um, here we go putting it back so that it will have a very tight uh, seal again and um, just gonna you know put this back as well put the camera on. Oops. trying to get rid of uh, the okay there's the seal and now um, I'm just putting these uh, three screws back on and before I do that I want to uh, put some grease in it so that next time when I try to open this up or somebody else want to try to open this up they can do it okay so there is the exhaust uh, seal okay putting the exhaust uh, thing back Okay, there we go. Okay. Okay, there we go. So, cleaned it, and um, now this exhaust should be good to go with all that dirt out four screws back okay I shouldn't be tearing this apart um, lessons learned I guess one two three four these four small screws okay. and these two screws are on the side so these are the side screws but these are the four screws I need now. So I'm just dipping them in there to get some grease so that next time I need to reopen these screws, they're not gonna be rusted out and then break. They're just gonna be, you know, greased. So they will just be very easy to unscrew these four screws.
Same thing with these big screws. Want them to have a lot of uh, grease in it so it won't uh, rust it out. One of them already got, um, you know, some rust. Condition. This one, this is the one that got um, into the rusty condition that can break the bolt. You can see here. So I'm going to try to grease it so that this screw is not going to break on me or on anybody. There we go. Same thing with all these uh, lower unit screws. I'm ready. Throw these in. Mm -hmm. 